Good morning, everybody. I popped on a couple seconds early, kind of get us going. Um, made a couple modifications. Hopefully, you guys can see a little bit better. Saturday morning, May 16th, 8.30. We're going to do a 10 by 10 this morning. I try to change up the exercises in the 10 by 10, uh, but the same concept. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so, I have a cheat sheet, which I could see great when I had my glasses on. I can't see without, so hopefully I can get through this one. But again, some, some different exercises in the 10 by 10. We know how it goes. Morning, everybody. Um, it's supposed to be a beautiful day. It's been a beautiful couple of days. So hopefully everybody's healthy. Hopefully you're all joining me and you're not just watching from the couch. Um, hope chest. Keep moving. We know that the best way to keep your immunity strong is to keep your body strong. So we're trying to focus on that. We're going to start re-talking about our BMI because I know that you know we've been home for a while so um, you know let's refocus let's get back into what we were talking about before and make sure that we that we're really focusing on our health outside of the current situation um, so anyways got some some music going um, 10 by 10 so have your weights close by know that we're gonna have weights in our hands for a long time so choose your weights wisely and let's get going Big March. Four, three, two, step touch. Double step. <laughs> Great vine. With a knee. Four more. We're going to add the around the world arms right here. Keep it going. Step touch. Knees up front, pull it down. Hamstring, reach and pull. Knees up front, four. Hamstrings, four. Knees, two. Hams, two. Knees, two. Hams, two. Knees, two. Hands two. Last time. And center squat. Down and up. Watch that squat. Watch that form. Weights in the heels. Lift the toes up. Keep the chin up. Really squeeze the glutes as you come up. Now reach for the floor. Right hand, left hand. We like to move it, move it. And that overhead extension. Down and up. Four more, four, three, two, one. Pulse it down, little pulse, widen that stance. Weights in the heels, feet are far apart. Little lunge, take it side to side. And reach. Up overhead, reach. Out in front, reach. By your toes, reach. In front, up overhead, in front, down low, in front, up high, in front, down low, in front, wide squat, center squat, down and up, press it back, pull it up, pulse it down, little pulse, hands on the quads, stay here. Round the back, release it. Round the back, release it. 
Round the back, roll it up. Feet together. Shoulders back. Elbows back. Arms back. Great big deep breath. If you need water, get water. We're going into cardio. We got some time, so get your water. Top of the minute. We got big plans for this weekend, right? Come on. Get, jump in with me. Five more seconds. We're going to go to that level one march, level two jog, level three run. Ready, set, go. One, two, or three. So level one march, level two jog, level three run it out. Get those feet going. Fast feet. Woo! Keep it going. No, I'm not even trying. Bury him, I'm not going to embarrass you. With my bad dancing. I don't know why that would embarrass you. You'd be embarrassed for me. Let's go. Five more seconds. And to jumping jacks. Level one. Level two. Level three. So let's go. Level one. Level two. Level three. Find something that works for you. Keep it going. Woo Ten more seconds. And into jump rope. Level one. Low impact. Medium. High. I gotta watch how high I jump here. So I'm gonna stay in the one. You can add a one and a two. So heel, heel, pop, pop. Heel, heel, pop, pop. Keep it going. Want to go to that heel toe for level one? Level one, heel toe. Heel toe, level two. Kick lunge. Kick lunge. Level three, kick, kick. Kick, kick. Kick, kick. You can get a little rocking horse going. Woo. Kick, kick. Keep it going. Ten more seconds before we switch sides. Keep the chin up. Keep the shoulders back. Don't let the head come forward. Here. Get ready to switch. And heel toe, level one. Level two, kick lunge. Kick lunge. Level three, kick, kick. Front. Push that door closed. Push the door closed. All from the heel. Woo! Keep it going. We're gonna go into mountain climbers. Five more seconds. Couple more. So mountain climbers, level one. Level two. Level three is on the floor or on your chair. I know I'm totally out of the picture there. But that's up against the wall. Let's go. Go down on the floor. Keep it going, keep it going. Ten more seconds. We're going to take it to over the top. So here, over the top. Level two gets a little hop. If you have a low ceiling, don't get the arms as high. Don't learn the hard way. Level one, just pivot on the feet. Drop that back knee down. Level two gets a hop. Level three is just faster. Five more seconds, then you're going to pick a side. Pick a side, one knee. Level one's down here. Level two is a little higher. Level three, ceiling. Level one, down here. Level two. Level three. Come on, you got ten more seconds this side. Ready, set, over the top, other side. Level one. Go. Level two, a little higher. Level three, ceiling, pull it down.
Ten more seconds. Keep it going. We're gonna come center. Level one is gonna sit back and give me circles. Level two, walk out to plank and walk back. Walk out to plank and walk back. Keep that going. Level one's here. Weight in the heel. Keep going. Out to plank. Level three, same thing. You want to add a push up at the end. You can. Give me one more. And into power jacks. Level one, side to side. Level two. Level three on the floor. Out and in. Let that chest come down. Otherwise, you're here. Whew. Great big power jack. Here. Or on the floor. Or on the floor. Keep it going, keep it going. Everybody's up. March or jog. March or jog. We know the deal, get that breathing under control. When I start to count, you're gonna give me fast feet to the count of 10, then we back it off. Ready, set, go, take it off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. March or jog. So it's as fast as you can go on those fast feet. Ready, set, go, take it off right here. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Back it off. We got one more. March or jog. One more. Ready? Set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. March. Nice job. Woo! Heart rate's high. We're gonna bring it down to a manageable plate. Oh, we never did a heart rate. Oh, nice. You guys probably said that in the beginning. Yeah, I bet you did. Chef touch. I bet you did. So hopefully we've been consistently checking it. And we kind of know where we are. So if I miss it one time, you're gonna remember what it was all those other times and try and get there after cool down. If we even make it to cool down. If we get there, and elbow. So if the video cuts out at the end, and I can't get back on, you know the stretches. No excuses, you need to stretch. March, march. So we're gonna bring it into obliques, but we're gonna bring it into those twists. So you're gonna take it wide, sit down, side to side side to side with those elbows. So nothing's moving but the elbows. Twisting at the waist. So we're going to stay here. We're going to take it to double time. And two more. Keep the elbows tight to the body. Double time. Here. Close to the body. Sitting back in those heels. Singles. Eight. Four. Three, two, one, side to side, double time. Keep those elbows tight to the body, twisting at the waist. Single, eight, seven, four more, four, three, two, one, last time, double. Keep the elbows nice and tight to the body. Just bring them belly button, belly button. In four, three, two, come center. Great big deep breath. Okay, get water. We're going into that 10 by 10. So different moves this time. As long as I can see this a little bit. So, our first move today kind of similar to what our normal, on the normal 10 by 10. And here's the thing, if you can't curtsy keeping those hips square or if you feel it in your knee, 
you're gonna come right back to that straight back lunge anyways. So it's up to you. But instead of doing that straight back, we're gonna try and curtsy. And we're gonna try and curl out. Ready? Curl, curtsy. Curl, curtsy. That's four more. In four, three. You know that's not right. Give me one more each side. Come center. So the second set, second set, we're gonna take the feet out. So after you finish this last, you're gonna come wide. And we're gonna sumo squat with that reach in between the feet. So just watch the knees, don't let the feet come forward. So back to that curtsy. Here we go. Curtsy. So whatever arm you wanna do, that's four. That's six. Two more, so on that last one, you're gonna take that wide step out. Take that wide step out. Toes are facing straight out front. Reach between the toes, keep the chin up. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What's gonna happen next is we're gonna lean forward. We're gonna keep this wide stance, but bend the knees, and we're just gonna do bench over rows with wide feet, okay? So we're starting back with the curtsies. Woo! Four, three, curtsy, here we go. Curtsy, curtsy. Four down. Five. One more each side, then we take that wide step out. Wide step out, toes forward, reach. Reach. Toes are straight out front, keep that chin up, keep watching me. That six, I'm pretty sure could be wrong, seven. Eight, nine, flat back, lean forward, and row. So pull those shoulder blades together. Four more, no, six more. Now four more. Four, three, two, one. What's gonna happen next? We're gonna turn out wide, and we're gonna come into plie. So after that bent over row, Toes turn out and place. So the shoulders are over the hips. From the top, you curtsy, bicep curl already. Here we go. Curtsy. Curtsy. Loosen up that death grip on that weight. Four down. One more each side. Take that wide stance. Reach. Watch those knees. If that reaches too much, just even that. Keep going. Four, three, close. We'll do a couple extra. It's all right. Now bend over and row. Pull it back. Keep that chin up. Keep watching me. Not all the way up. Level five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, toes out, down and up, down and up. Four more, four, three, two, one. So what's gonna happen after that? Toes are gonna come forward, and we're gonna go for those lunges side to side. Now remember, if that reaches too much, you can lunge here, but make sure that that knee is not coming forward, that you're here to here, okay? Be ready. From the tippy top, curtsy with that bicep curl. Take it side to side. Breathe it out. Watch that form. Keep the chin up, shoulders back. Six, seven, eight, nine, wide foot out. 10 and sumo, right here. Reach right between the feet, that will force you into proper form. That's four. That's six. That's eight. Lean forward, flat back, and pull it in. 
So slight bend in those knees. Slight bend in the knees. Pull it right to the waist. Seven, eight, nine. Now lunge it down right here. Side to side or both weights. Side to side. Seven, eight, nine, ten. We're gonna take those weights down now. Halfway already. That doesn't even seem like it's right. Okay, get some water. Get some water. Woo. So we're gonna do one set of Tabata. We're gonna come back, finish up that other half. Then we're gonna get on the floor. So you guys got 20 seconds. Use it wisely. I have to be able to see. You ready to go? Five seconds and it's gonna be fast feet. It's gonna be fast feet. Ready, set, go, fast feet. Take it up right now, 20 seconds, fast as you can go. Let's go. Run it out, fast as you can go. If you're fast, this is a march. March proud, chin up, shoulders back. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, stop. We're gonna go to the jump the puddle. So it's here to here. Watch that foot, make sure you're landing on a nice flat foot. Ready, set, go, jump the puddle, jump the puddle. Level one, you can be here, low impact. Level two, level three is just fast, get it going. Side to side. Five more seconds. And stop. We're gonna go to jump rope or side to side jump rope. So if you wanna twist, you can twist. You can twist. Or just a jump rope, ready, set, go, let's go. Fast as you can, fast as you can. You don't really have a rope, you can be here. You can get the arms going here. Whatever works for you. You want the heart rate up higher, you know the arms have to come up. Let's go. Five more seconds. And stop. We're gonna go to those heel digs. So here or here. Hold on. Ready, set, go. Heel digs, heel digs. Let's go. Heel digs. Kind of like the jump rope, but the jump rope's a little closer to the body. Heel digs are out front. You can't get the arms going if you want to. Hold, keep going, keep going. Stop. Halfway. Woo! Halfway, we're doing the same thing all over again. Fast feet to start. Ready, set, go, fast feet. Fast feet, let's go. Work your work in. Breathe it. Get it under control, 10 more seconds. Five more seconds. Come on, dig a little deeper. Three, two, one, stop. We're gonna jump the puddle. Ready to go. And jump the puddle. Here we go, jump the puddle. Woo. Jump the puddle. You can be here. Or here. Side to side, flat foot, land on that flat foot. Three, two, one. Stop. Two more. Jump ropes and then heel days. Ready, set, jump ropes. Let's go. Let's go. Woo. We know the deal. You could be here. So for a little heel digs, jump rope center, as opposed to these that are coming next. Come on, you got seven more seconds. Come on. Three, two, one, stop. One more, those heel days. Get those arms involved if you want to. Last set, best set. Ready, set, go. Heel digs, heel digs with the arms. Up front. Come on. Yes, you can. This is our second set of cardio already. We're not even a half an hour in. Come on, let's go. 
three, two, one, and march it out. Woo. And step touch. In four, in three, in two, and one, march, march, march. So, to bring our heart rate down, we're just going to do some donkey kicks. So if you want to get your chair out, you can get your chair out. Let's just do a little elbow back. A couple of these. A lot of times during cardio, you tense up in the neck and shoulders. So we want to loosen this up. Now march, march. So what do I mean? The donkey kick standing here, it's here. So these are what we do on the floor. Today we're going to do them standing. You can hold on to something or just balance. Here we go. Press it back. So it can be press back, tap, or press back, knee in. Press back. Four. Three. Keep those shoulders up and back. Now pulse that heel up to the ceiling. Four. Three, two, second set. Press, pull, or press and tap. Four more. Four, three, two, one. Press it back. Eight. Four, three, third and final set. Press and pull, or press and tap. Four more, four, three, two, pulse it back, last time this side, eight, four, three, two, one, march. So I'm going to turn my chair on so I can keep facing you. So we have something for balance for this side. Ooh, we're going to need to stretch that out. So other side, press and pull, or press, and tap. One press and pull, four, three, two, one, pulse it back. Press that heel back, shoulders are up and back. Second set, press, pull, or press, tap. Keep it going, in four. In three, in two, pulse it back right here, pulse eight. Third and final set, here we go. Press, pull, or press, tap. Four more, four, three, two, one, and pulse it back, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and set it down. March it out wide. Hands on the hips, hinge forward. And roll it up. Deep breath. So you guys get water. I'm gonna talk about where we're going next. So we finished with these lunges side to side. What's gonna happen is we're gonna come down into lawnmower. So it's going to be a little different on this 10 by 10 because there's actually going to be 20 on the lawn mowers. We're going to do 10 on this side and then we're going to come over to 10 on this side. So the way it works, do not put your hand on your knee. You can put your weight here or your elbow and it's here, pull that elbow back across the body. Okay, so now we know the move. I'm going to turn my chair back around so I have my room. Turn over the first five exercises. I hope I do because I can't see them. I should have wrote them in a darker marker as opposed to a pen. Okay. Curtsy with that bicep curl. Ten. Six more like that. Watch that curtsy. Keep those hips square. One more each side. Wide stance and sumo. 
right here. Keep that chin up. That's four. I need you, Kim. You keep me in line. That's six. That's eight. Lean forward and pull it in. You can alternate right and left if you want to. Four down. Keep it going. By the knees, right to the waist. Give me two more. Turn those feet out and plie. Two down, eight to go. Keep the shoulders back. Four down. I don't know. That's eight, give me two more. Toes forward and lunges. Take it side to side or both. That's four. That's six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come down to one side and pull. Pull. Watch that knee. Pull it right here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten, other side. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What's going to happen next? We're going to pull the feet close together and we're going to take it into those tricep extensions. So we know the elbows are drawn back and then you extend. You ready? Curtsy, here we go. Ten. Whew. Four down. That's eight. Nine. Take this foot out wide. Right here, sumo. Shoulders back, chin up. Watch those knees. Keep the weight in the heels. That's four. That's six, eight, nine. Keep a nice flat back and pull it in. Inhale, exhale. Exhale as you pull back. Four down. Seven, eight. We're going to go in those plies. Nine, ten. Turn the toes up. Plie. Feet are wide right here. Wide. Knees are not passing over the toes. That's six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Turn those toes straight forward right here. And lunge side to side. So one leg stays straight, the other leg bends. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten, come down right here and pull, one arm, one arm, all the way back, five, six, seven, eight, nine, other side, here we go, so if leaning that far down is too much, put the hand on the quad, just watch that knee, four down, five, six, remember where we're going, Seven, eight, nine, pull the feet together, ten, extend back. Whew. Four down. You can alternate. Six down. Eight, nine, ten. What's going to happen next is we're going to pull the shoulders back, the hands are going to come out in front, and you're going to be here. So if you don't have that range of motion, you don't have that extension, you can pull the elbows back around the body. Hold on one second. Allergies this morning. Ooh. Okay, so we're going on to, so up front rows, eight. Now we bicep curl with the curtsy. Keep going, keep those hips square. Four down. Four. 
That's eight, nine, wide stand sumo squat, wide. Reach right between the feet, keep the shoulders back, chin up. Five, six, the weights from the heels. Seven, eight, nine, flat back, lean forward and pull it in. Exhale as you pull it back, bring those shoulder blades together. Four down. Five, six, nice flat back. Eight, nine, ten, turn the toes out. Plie. Keep it going, two down, eight to go. I know, Kim, I'm trying. Six down, seven, eight, nine, toes out front, and lunge it side to side. Side to side. Remember, one knee bends, other leg stays straight, that's four. That's six. That's eight, give me one more each side. Coming down into lawnmower, pull. Across the body, you could stay on that side we were on. If that's smoother. Six down, start that lawnmower. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Take it to the other side. Pull, 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 four down. Five, six, remember tricep extensions are next. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Draw the feet together, extend. Extend, keep going. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're up front. Pull it up right here. I'm somehow off the beat. Okay, so that's four, five, six, seven, I know it's not, eight, nine, ten. What's going to happen next? We're going to turn the hands out, and the weights are going to be here, and we're going to go to these kind of wide buttons. So it's like a hammer curl, but it's out. So the elbows are pinned, and it's here to here. You can alternate if you want to. Up to you. Otherwise, you could do plain, plain wide. You can go here if that's better for you. Ready from the top. Curtsy with the curl. Here. Whew. Four down. Keep that thumb up. That's eight, nine, ten, and wide. Sumo. Two down. Keep that reach. That's four. That's six, right here. Eight, nine, flat back, lean over and pull. Pull, weight to the heels, keep those toes up. Nice flat back. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten, toes out, and plie. Shoulders over the hips, back, we're not throwing the chest forward. That's six, right there, seven. Eight, we're going in the lunges, you ready? Nine, wide lunges, side to side, here to here, or here to here, that's four down. Five, six, Seven, eight, I'm gonna try staying on the side. Nine, ten, stay here and pull. Pull it, keep going. Three, four, again, you're not on your knee. Six down, seven, eight, nine, switch sides right here. Ten, start that lawnmower. Whew. Four down. Seven. Eight. Remember going in tricep extensions. Nine. Feet together. Kick it back. 
Elbows are up high. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Straighten up and row it straight up. Zip those zippers, you can alternate. If you want to be up on the tippy toes, I guess you can do that too. Seven, eight, nine. Turn those hands over, here we go. Two down. You can alternate. Six down. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we're going into our last one, ten of ten. So we know the deal, and you know the count. What happens with the last, the ten of ten? You're either gonna come down and hold the squat, or you're gonna come down and hold a plank. So it's up to you, but that's a one minute hold. So, we're gonna finish up, 10 of 10, waiting for the beat, we're coming into that curtsy with the bicep curl. 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, wide squat, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, lean forward, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, yes you did, 76, 77, 78, keep that back flat, 79, 80, toes out, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, toes forward, 70, and lunge, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, stay here, 41, you know the deal, 44, 46, 48, 49, 50, other side, same thing, 41, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, stand in, 31, 32, 33, watch the form, you can alternate, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, up front, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, turn it over, 11, 12, 13, finish this, let's go, you got this, give me four more. 18, 19, 20, down into that plank or that squat. So you're either here holding a squat or you're down in the plank. Here, hands directly under the shoulder. Nice flat back. Ready? Oh, in. So you're there. If you're in the squat, if you're holding that squat, you can step over and step back. Stay down low or stay in that plank. Keep going, you're not even halfway there yet. Now you're halfway there. Tap out, tap in. If you want to bring one knee in, just make sure you don't bring that fanny up. Out and in, 
I have a hand. Keep going. You have 15 seconds. You got this. Yes, you can. Come on. Breathe it out. Mind over matter. Right now, your butt is the matter. Let's go. 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven. Don't stand up. Don't stand up. Four, three, two, one. Roll it up. Whew. Nice job. 10 of 10. Give me a little hamstring curl. Little hamstring curl, side to side. Ooh. Ooh. Give me a little elbow roll back. Elbow roll back. Okay, a little bit bigger. Give me a great big deep breath. Press it out front. Open that back up. You just work that back hard. Fingertips back on one side. Other side. Press it, hands together, and just push it out. You'll feel that lat open up, the round boards open up. Push it out. Traps. Both hands behind the back, delts and chest. Woo! Okay. Right. We're going to get on the floor. We're going to do some push ups. So I'm going to use the chair. We've been using the chair for modified. I'm gonna push it up against my step so that it's in view. So it's right up against something. I'm back a little farther. I've given myself a little more room in here. I don't know how much of the room you can see, but the spin bike is there. My basement was refinished in 1972 with all the finest finishes. Okay. So. If you can't do push-ups at all, you can be on the floor with the weights doing the chest presses. So we know how to do that. I'm gonna turn this down just a smidge. So you can be on the floor doing regular push-ups. If you're super strong, do regular push-ups. Otherwise, I want your knees back, I want your back flat, and your hands on the front of the chair. So not up here, but on the front of the chair, and bring the chest down. Down. Press back. Now, you want it easier, get a little closer to the chair. We know the deal. The longer the lever, the harder the work. So if you want to be here and you know your chair is secure, you can be up on your toes. Two, one. Let's sit back. Hands on the heels. Just give me a little stretch. Come back up, hands on the chair. Here we go. 16. Chest down, press back. Four down. Eight down. Give me four more. Four. Three. Two. One, come on back. Hands on the heels. Come on back. You got one more. Yes, you can. Ready? One more set. So, you can come down for two. And back for two. Down for two. Back for two. If you want to do a single, just make sure your back stays nice and flat. Again, you want it easier. Get a little closer to the chair. Keep going. Four more like that. Three more. Two more like that. If you're doing flies, you mimic this move. One more. Oh, here we go. Bring it back. Hands behind the back. We're going to go into abs and then we're going to stretch. We have just enough time. Just enough time. So I'm going to move the weights out of my way. So your feet can be up on the chair. Hands behind your head and crunch. They can be on top of the chair. They can be on the front of the chair. They can just be lifted. So obviously, holding them up is the most challenging. Now reach right here. One side, then the other side. Like you're trying to touch the ankle. Four, 
three, two, just stay to one side. So you're just supporting this head, you're not pulling on it. Four more this side, four, three, two, switch sides right here, eight. Four more this side in four, three, two, both hands behind the head, support the head, elbows up, chest up. Now bring one knee in to meet it. Eight. Give me four more like that. In four. We're going into double knees. Ready? Double knees. Here we go. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Finish strong. Two. One. Hold the knees to the chest. Hold the knees. You guys stay there. I'm going to move the chair out of the way. So I have room to stretch. Okay, I'm going to change the music. So you guys are still hugging the knees and rocking side to side. Rocking side to side. Take both knees to one side, arms to the other side, reach. Nice long stretch through the lower back. From the center. Take it the other way. From the center. You're gonna bring one knee to the chest and straighten that leg out. Straight as you can get it, giving that gentle rotation in the ankle. Take it the other way. Let the knee drop out long. The leg drop out long, sorry. Keep those hips nice and flat. Bring it to center, bend the knee, ankle crosses over the other leg, just reach through and pull it in. Other side, straighten that leg. We started knee to chest. Straighten the leg, gentle rotation in that ankle. And the other way. Support that leg, let it drop out to the side. Keep those hips flat, anchored to the ground. Center knee drops out, bend the knee, cross the ankle over that leg and pull it in. Bottom of the feet together, use the elbows to push the knees out, bottom of the feet together. Hands slip underneath the ankles, grab the outside of the shoes and give it that gentle rock, happy baby. And release it. Walk the feet out. Give me that long stretch overhead. And release that. Drop the arms down by the side, palms to ceiling, close the eyes, and focus on that breathing. Deep breath in through the nose, and exhale through the mouth. Deep breath in through the nose. Hold it. Exhale through the mouth. Deep breath through the nose. 
hold it. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale through the nose. Hold it. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale. Hold it. Exhale. Inhale. Hold it. Exhale. One more time through. Inhale. Hold it. And exhale. Return to your regular breathing pattern, in through the nose, out through the nose. On the next inhale, I want you to give the fingers a little wiggle. On the next deep breath in, on the exhale, I want you to open the eyes and give the toes a little wiggle. Next inhale, draw one knee to the chest and hold it there. Exhale. Inhale, other knee comes up to meet it. Exhale. Great big deep breath in. On the exhale, rock the body up. Well, we're still together, so that's a good sign. Wide straddle stretch. It means today's gonna be a good day. Hands on the floor. Deep breath in. On the exhale, walk the fingertips out. So we still got our ladies still providing classes, still still here on Facebook to take care of you. Make sure that you're following them. Our ladies, and we have our friend Alex doing Zumba. So join Alex for Zumba. He's just a joy. It was just his birthday too, so hands to one foot, reach. We got Linda Ann putting stuff up. Ellen is on every single day, so you have no excuses. Walk it over to the other side. Kathy's putting spin videos out as much as she can. I know a lot of her music gets blocked, so she's been having some challenges. Um, but she's she's here. You know she's got our back. One hand on each foot. We love you, Kathy. One hand each side. Stacia's out there. Arissa's putting out great videos you can take outside. Do them outside in your yard. One leg straight out, one foot to the inner thigh. Nice flat back, bring that chest down. It's supposed to be warm today. Get outside. Foot up and over. Elbow over the shoulder. Well, the elbow's not over the shoulder. Elbow's behind the knee, look over the shoulder. So 10 by 10 again. I know how much you guys love that. Down onto the hip. And other side. Great thing to say at the end of a workout, foot to the inner thigh. Should have said this at the very beginning. It's form over weight every single time. So if at any point in the workout you feel exhausted, you feel like you've worked to exhaustion, put the weights down and just do the motions. Foot up and over. Elbow. You got enough going on. The last thing you work, the last thing that you need is to injure yourself working out. So let's not do that. Down onto the hip. So when it comes center, find your pulse either in your wrist or your neck and start counting. Hold on, start counting now. And stop. So at around or near 15. You're at home, so if you need to stay on the floor for a little while longer and you still want to stretch, I know Lisa, you like to stretch a little longer, stay down on the floor. Take your time. Feet are wide. Press it forward. Hands on the floor. And roll it up. Head to the last thing. Shoulders back. Elbows back. Arms back. 
Take a big deep breath, pull to one side. Center, pull to the other side. Center, release it one last time. Great big deep breath. Awesome job today, ladies. Have a great day. Get outside, get some fresh air. We'll see you on Monday night, 5.30.